uppercut, uppercut, sonic boom! Well, hello there, humans, bees, earthlings, wherever you are, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, and if you're lucky enough indeed to be doing it too, welcome back to another clips that YouTubers don't want to show you. And we're going to start this off with the miracle on Sanok. This is possibly the greatest moment of potato aiming I have ever seen in my life. Now, I hit three or four shots there, fair enough. He's got an M249. Watch this. What? I... I want you to watch that again. <laughs> in slow-mo. This is him attempting to thirst me. That's... <laughs> I don't know what he's shooting at! <laughs> he's drawn a stencil around the outside of my body! We ended up winning that one. Good work, Ouija. He got me up as well. This is the Age of Server where we are truly sweaty. We know what sweat's all about. Uh, there's two blokes here. I'm dropping solo squads. No problems at all. Here we go. First member of the squad's going to roll on in. We're going to do the business. Oh, took a bit of a punish. We're going to get ready for the second member of the squad. Here we go. Get ready to poke out. Here we go. On a hot drop. He's got an Uzi. He's climbed the roof with his 1.85 kill death ratio. And he's going to live forever. <laughs> okay. This one is a really... Really weird one. You might have seen this one if you watch my Instagram feed. I drop a lot of Instagram vids. Uh, it's at the Bushka on Instagram. A lot of followers. I think we've got 25,000 followers now. But watch watch Mr. Ouija run into me as I try and push back to the left so I don't get hit. Here he comes. And bounce! Yeah, I don't know either. Do you see me just do a twirl? Like, um, I, why am I in a house? Okay, hang on. I'm in a house. How did I get in a house? That's not good. Uh, this was on the live stream. And uh, yeah, it's on the live stream. I get these idiots all the time that say, try that on Asia server or everyone's a bot. So there's a guy driving towards me in a, in a VW, right? And then the guy that shot me with an SLR took like, I don't know, 25% of my health up there to the southeast somewhere. And I kill him. And then some idiot gets in the chat and goes, stop playing against bots, man. Like... You guys are a bunch of morons. <laughs> what? Bots don't drive cars and bots don't shoot at that range with SLRs and do lots of damages. Is there anyone else? I, I can't be the only one that does this. The inexplicable, unnecessary reload that gets you killed. Watch this. One. No problem. Reload. Why? Why am I reloading there? I had 20 rounds left and I reloaded and that was for a chicken dinner. Like, that is... That is crazy. Absolutely plum tucker crazy. I don't know what possesses me, but I've done it so many times and it drives me insane. And every time I do it, I think, I'm never doing that again. That's ridiculous. You know who's never doing this again? The blokes in this car. I don't know what they are thinking. This is not how you push a compound that is absolutely going ham. Hello! It's like the Dukes of Hazard. Just a good old boys. Wouldn't change if they could. Sit down. Thanks very much. I'll have all your gear. Wonderful driving. I wonder what the uh, Discord or the in-game chat was like there. This was not the only thing that happened. A lot of lot of kills happened in this compound. I've got up to nine kills now. Watch this. So I'm going to knock this bloke in the open out there. His squad mate has exactly the same outfit on. Exactly. He could go over the back of the ridge, go around it, and come up to those gas cans, and he'd be safe as houses. Instead, I swear to God, I just knocked your mate doing exactly the same thing in exactly the same place. What are you doing? Uh, PUBG Mobile keeps resetting my controls. This is me trying to find the exit key. Watch. Um, where's the exit key? I just want to get out. Where's the exit? There's the exit key! Oh, there I got you! Oh, it's come back here! Fight fair, you grub! At least I got to take out the bloke who was third partying on the blue. I mean, seriously. But they, I, they reset my controls all the time. That's happened twice. One of them was for a chicken dinner. Thankfully, the rest of the squad did the business and we got the chicken dinner. But this is hilarious. So there's a squad or two blokes left down there fighting over this airdrop. Okay. We roll up. Uh, I got that guy. We go to push down and someone takes off in a car. You can see we start shooting at the car right there. I'm going to adjust the visual so you can watch that car sail off into the distance. He's got all the airdrop stuff, by the way. He's uh, looted the airdrop. Let's let's check him out at the top left side of your screen. You can see him going up there. He's driving away. Pretty damaged car. He's got the boost on. He's going as fast as he can. And whoops, that'll be a tree. And he's dead. Yeah, we got the airdrop gear. 
<laughs> this was amazing. This guy, I swear to God, he was driving up this mountain for five minutes trying to get to the top. And Weidra and I are just like, is he is he seriously going to the top of the mountain? I think he is. We ended up running all the way around the other side, coming out the top just as this poor grub crested the top of the hill in his Zima, got out and was like, I'm king of the world. Feels bad, man. Feels very, very bad. What is what is wrong with people? We're, okay, there's a bloke up there. He sees me, I see him. We both throw grenades. That's a smoke grenade. Uh, that is a smoke. He's throwing a smoke grenade at me. I throw a frag grenade at him. Guess which one works? <laughs> I don't. Like, why do you throw a smoke grenade at me? And this guy's been behind this tree for like five minutes. I don't know why people in TPP do this. They think the other guy is going to peek or something. And they just sit there and like, it is so sweaty on Asia at the moment. Like this guy is on the other side of this building, as is on the right. Every time we try and get near him, um, he peeks the corner. I'm just like, eventually, you know what? I don't think he's going to move. Let's see what happens if I throw a grenade at him. Yeah, he's not going anywhere. Um, the It's just nuts. There's yeah, people... Yeah, in-game chat going on here with me and the Ouija. Here he is. There he is. Oh, hello. Like, you're lying down. You're lying down. You what are you doing? Uh, Sweaty Asia. Want to see Sweaty Asia? This is FPP. I mean, snaking in FPP is stupid, but there you go. This bloke's uh, got the... Got, got the drop covered. What a great bloke. He's, his actual squad was all in a ring lying down around that drop. What about these two? Late game, 13 left alive. Last compound in the circle. You guys out the back. There's definitely something in here as here. As uh, I'm just going to go check the stairs. Firstly, this bloke. Yeah, but then watch his mate drop out of the ceiling. Oh, hello, Spider-Man. How are you going? Good to see you. <laughs> Haven't seen you since that party at Superman's joint. Hope you're enjoying yourself. Uh, he's nearly wrecked us. Just go up there and finish him, would you? Thanks very much. That'd be great. Always walk very, very softly and carry a Ouija in your back pocket. It's been a hell of a week. It's, it's, I can't complain too much. So this is me doing the same thing. I'm happy to come down when I know that bloke's got a crossbow. Like, you know, worst gun in game, by the way, the UMP. What an absolute joke of a gun. Hey, take the thing. Go. It's just, they've just destroyed it. They've just ruined it. I wasn't sure if this guy's a hacker at first. Um, he's since been in Bronze 5. So he's definitely a hacker. Um, yeah, he hit me at like 200 meters with a freaking... And then I was just like, I'm not sure if he's a hacker, if he's just lucky. And he's just walking around crates. And then suddenly, oh, I think I'll just go for a run over here because I'm feeling like I need to get the steps up on the Fitbit. And uh, and maybe while I'm running, I'll just pull out the Mini 14 and uh, with the 8 scope in case I, you know... I, I see something over here like an alligator or a shark that I need to shoot that's in the water. Hang on. Maybe I'll get there really quickly. Quick, pull out the thing because the shark's down. There's a shark down there. I, I sensed it. I sensed it. What if I shoot him in the head? 60. Yeah. Report. Cheating. Thanks very much. Pretty certain that one's a, uh, a guaranteed knockout. And he is in bronze five now. Uh, here we go. Two eggs on an M24. I'm like, okay. I hit that guy a couple of times. Uh, the bloke over there got killed. Surely I can hit this shot too. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's like the edge of Render, man. That is so far away. This is the weirdest game I've had pretty much ever in PUBG Mobile, right? We started out and I had to go get Junior. So got some nice gunfighting done up here in Picardo, okay? And then later on, still the same hot drop. Uh, bloke jumps out the... There he goes off the top turnbuckle. Doesn't quite hear me with the good stuff going on, but then I knock him with the crossbow. Now, then I've got to go, okay? I've got to go get Junior from school. So I tell the boys, don't worry, you guys just go. And I just go AFK and go. But I leave it running. I'm going to fast forward this like 20 times the speed. Um, and I just run, and I run, and I run on no health. I'm on like 10 health, not even, two health. I run, and I run, and I run, and I run, and I run. I get stuck in a ditch. I come back and there's like seven people left alive. The boys pick me up. And we go and get a chicken dinner. <laughs> How about it? <laughs> and I got the MVP because I did a lot of damage at the start. Ah, uh, it's a wild old world. I, this was a, I, I'm going to leave you here with this. This was a really, really odd game. See that rooftop over there? You watch, man. There's just like, there's, there's people, you can see people in the background. That guy's just taking out a guy right at the back under the five sec. I'm like, oh, he's over there somewhere. Uh, must be on one of these balconies. Let's go and see. Um, 
So we go over here, we, we knock this bloke, and then another dude turns up on the same rooftop as the two guys that I just killed, literally right after I've killed them, and I've killed this bloke here who's... I don't know what he was doing in the corner, just panicking. And I, I move to the next window across. It takes maybe 10 seconds to do. And then more guys turn up on the roof. I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, no, fine, fine. We'll knock you out. And then another guy in the left-hand side of the screen there, he just decides to go out in the little planter box. After I kill his mate in the roof, he just lies down like he's planting some flowers in, in the rooftop garden. Um, people are so funny. PUBG Mobile is absolutely crazy. I'm loving it. Hope you're having a good time. If you like these videos, remember to like and subscribe. Look after yourselves. Stay safe in the battlefield. And bye for now.